Hello, friends. The harsh beauty of the North is mesmerizing. And the animals that live there seem to be unafraid of sub-zero temperatures, even though the cold is merciless. If you haven't lived in the North, then it is nearly impossible for you to imagine the cold of minus 54 degrees Celsius. This is the kind of cold that gets animals to freeze to the ice. A poor dog was found by the employees of the Central District Hospital in Yakushia. The animal turned out to be frozen to the ice with all four of its paws. The poor thing had to be rescued from the ice captivity with the help of a crowbar and a fire hook. After the rescue, the dog was warmed up and fed. The next day, it was taken to the vet clinic. It turned out that there were no fractures, but it had slight frostbite on the paws. After a short treatment, the stray dog was sheltered by a colleague of the rescuers, an employee of the hospital catering department. It's a good thing that kind people happened to be nearby. And this cat lost one of its nine lives, but fortunately got to keep its paws. In the Chelyabinsk region of Russia, a couple rescued a frozen cat. The animal was sitting in a puddle when the severe cold hit, binding its paws in the icy trap. Despite the fact that it was a Norwegian forest cat, which can handle cold weather and is unafraid of water, the weather conditions played against it that time. Fortunately, the cat was freed from the frozen puddle with the help of warm water, then it was wrapped in a blanket and taken home. Many animals try to get to the opposite bank of the river on the first ice. But because the ice is slippery and fragile, not all of them manage to survive such a journey. When the legs of the animals sprawl, they get multiple injuries and can no longer move independently. It's very fortunate if there are people around who are willing to come to the animal's rescue in moments like these. This deer was rescued from a mud slurry that it fell into after the ice had collapsed. The deer was immersed in the mud up to its chest, so the animal had no chance of surviving on its own. But the help came from where it was least expected. The hunters rescued the deer. In the next video, firefighters rescued a moose stranded in the middle of an icy river in Sweden. The wild animal fell through the ice and couldn't get to shore on its own. The help arrived just in time, as the animal was completely exhausted. Four rescuers dragged the moose to the bank, where it was able to get out of the water on its own. And here's another incident in Yakusha. According to Andrei Sofronov, an agricultural specialist of the Agma Village Administration, it happened in the morning. Two farmer's cows fell through the ice on Lake Banyak Kul. Apparently, they were on their way from the watering place to the cowshed. Incidents like these happen during this time of the year because the ice isn't strong enough yet. The owners need to be extremely careful and it is best to accompany their animals to the watering place. The cows were noticed by another farmer, Vyacheslav Kristoforov. He took photos on his smartphone and sent them to the village WhatsApp group. They quickly found out who the cattle belonged to and organized the rescue operation. And this incident happened in Russia. St. Petersburg animal rescuers helped the seagull. The bird had been imprisoned in the Neva River for several days. It was sitting on some ice that was broken off by the icebreaker not far from the coast. It was noticed by a woman who went out for a run on the embankment. According to her, she didn't see the motionless bird at first, but the very next day, the woman realized that it was frozen, so she called the Koshkispas. She learned about them in a group called Koshkispas Animal Rescue. They made their way to the bird on a hovercraft. One of the rescuers had to use heavy tools to get the seagull off the ice floe and then carefully crawl to the embankment since the ice at the edge was rather fragile. They used a net to raise the injured bird with several kilograms of ice stuck to it. 
The rescuers left some ice because they didn't want to accidentally injure the bird. After soaking the bird in the bathtub of the woman who first saw it, they saw that the wings and the legs of the seagull weren't injured, which meant that it had a great chance of returning to nature after treatment and rehabilitation. The poor bird was taken under the care of the Siren Center for Rehabilitation and Reintroduction of Wild Animals. And this video shows the rescue operation of a female red deer, which fell through the ice. A small group of committed locals gathered to help save the animal. The ice wasn't thick enough in some places, which posed a serious danger, so they had to act very quickly. Nevertheless, the rescue operation was successful. And some time later, the animal got better, which allowed it to return to its habitat safely. The next episode shows some passerbys who noticed that a moose had fallen through the ice and called the rescuers. The rescue team arrived and saw the animal floundering in the icy water. It was impossible to approach the moose because of the thin ice. So the rescuers had to use an inflatable boat. One of the rescuers got close to the animal and threw a rope around its neck. It took him three attempts. The people left on the bank began to pull the boat along with the moose. The rescued animal was in no hurry to leave for the forest, but instead began to feast on the young twigs in the nearby bushes, as if nothing had happened. It would seem that this Bambi got itself into a funny situation. The deer found itself on the ice and had problems keeping its legs together, thus being unable to get up. However, the truth is that it was a rather serious predicament, since the deer could have died of hypothermia. It no longer had the strength to get up or crawl on the icy surface. Kind people dragged it to shore, where the rescuee ran into the forest immediately. And this poor thing was discovered by three friends driving by in their car. They noticed something floundering on the slippery ice. When they got closer, they saw a deer that couldn't get up and get out of the ice trap. The guys rescued the animal and helped it get to a safe place. One might say that this elk got lucky, because when the ice broke under it, it was so close to the shore. Apparently, the animal was crossing the river and the thin ice couldn't hold it. But the elk managed to get ashore on its own. And here, the elk fell through the ice in the middle of the river. The wild animal spent at least an hour in the icy water. The ice near the shore turned out to be so thick that the elk couldn't break through it to make its way to the bank. Only people could help the animal out. A team of hunters came to the rescue of the forest animal. With the help of a chainsaw, they created a path for the animal to come to shore. After a little rest and having gathered its strength, the wild animal finally managed to get up and get on solid ground. The rescue operation took almost an hour and a half. After making sure that the animal was all right, the rescue team also went home. And that's all for today, friends. Have you ever fallen through the ice? Share your thoughts on this video in the comments. Like the video, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.